All right, yins guys, I'm gonna try to not um, yammer on and on about this and uh, make a 20 hour uh, fucking video about this, but uh, yeah, you know what, actually, uh, I'm sick and tired of on TV already for fuck's sakes already. Um, yeah, Meghan Merkel, Markle, or whatever the fuck her name is, and uh, Prince uh, Harry, uh, Henry, or Prince Harry ass or whatever his name is. Don't get me wrong. They didn't do nothing to me. I don't hate him or wish anything bad at him. But if, yeah, I know any situation, I don't care if, uh, what financial state you're in, you know, uh, rich, uh, royalty or whatever the fuck it is, or you can be some dude or chick, you know, rich kid or rich chick, you're, you're tired of a certain way. Oh, they left royalty. They got to blow the trumpet, okay? I mean, I can see a scenario where... Uh, for whatever reason, they wanted a damn, uh, I'm trying not to laugh about this because, um, I keep having different ideas in my head, cartoonish ideas, and it makes me want to laugh and I want to lose, and I don't want to start this video over, uh, over and over and over, but, uh, all right, yeah, you leave royalty, you hear these, like, other stories, I mean, if it was you or me and we were royalty and left, why the fuck would you be blowing the trumpet, Okay. You'd be taking some kind of money you got, and you'd want to leave a pr private life, and maybe not want to get some house where that whatever money you do get to take with you when you leave the royalty, and you don't got the handouts and everything, right? I mean, this applies like say if you were a rich, in a rich family, you want to just take off and leave. You had some money on your own, and hopefully they don't. Uh, get pissed off and just shut off whatever money, like, say, some, what if some of it, even though you say it's your money, right, in a real, in a real life fucking scenario, or like any kind of stereotypical, uh, that's kind of like a, I don't want to say kind of like a mafia family, or any kind of family where in real situations or other people in a, in a rich culture, they can, even though something is your money to a certain extent, they can shut it off because it's not really yours, it's, I don't know, you got the rich parents, right? Take off and leave and then cut ties, go to a place that's not too fucking expensive, you know, and drive a car, change the kind of clothes you wear. But no, they don't do that shit. They blow the fucking trumpet and uh, they want to get handouts on under the guise of a list of the other fucking shit that I don't want to do a whole 20-minute video, 20-hour video about, right? I mean, it's all a bunch of... Fucking uh, hogwash, a uh, bunch of horse shit, a load of horse shit, and uh, public media loves it. They come to maybe uh, the United States and expect in so many words to be treated like royalty. Blowing the trumpet, going on Oprah and going on other talk shows. Look at us, oh boo hoo hoo, and uh, the prince uh, with his beta male simpin' uh, and uh, following her around everywhere, uh, boohoo, uh, got, he got, um, she got him wrapped around her little finger, and it's a fucking, fucking joke, the biggest damn joke of the century, okay, if you really wanted to leave somewhere, why would the fuck would you blow the trumpet say you want to be left, oh no, um, uh, say in a scenario like theirs or a rich family, okay, if you're still following me here, and I'm trying not to laugh, you know, I'm trying not to jump the subject, trying not to laugh my ass off, talk about this video, but, okay, um, yeah, say you, you're rich or you're one of them and you leave a certain area, you, you get some money you take with you, right, you worry about, might run out, get a modest place somewhere, not a ghetto, not a dump, but some kind of, you know, decent car, and, but no, okay, they got, they want to uh, live off handouts like they're royalty and shit, right, I mean, in a better scenario, they'd be getting, taking advantage of that money, maybe start a business like Americans, some uh, honest Americans do, uh, do something like that, and honestly, and say one, whatever amount of money runs out, say if they were to squander it, they bring it with them, if say it's a few million, you know, a million dollars or so can go fast, you know, kind of lifestyle, you're a spoiled lifestyle you want to leave, no, you got to get some kind of shit on the people that doesn't really look like the people they look down on to, 
both black and white people on welfare. Oh, and they want to act like that they're woke, that they care about poor people of different races, and while well, they want to be on their little high, uh, their high horse there, you think they'd be standing out in the fucking cold on some holiday, you know, uh, next to a store, you know, trying to collect money for some, uh, a homeless place. Oh yeah, there may be a food kitchen if they have their showy lifestyle and some kind of car. Man, yeah, a couple, like, different kind of uh, people like them, their asses would be, like, freezing to death under uh, conditions that uh, people like you and me, oh, 25 degrees, you know, uh, me dressed like this, you know, uh, you know, 25 degrees sitting on a porch, you know, like, we're considered crazy or something, and they'd just Freeze to death and, uh, how, like, how, this is like the, yeah, that's the biggest bunch of damn bullshit, because, yeah, what the fuck would they, they do if this was done honestly? Would they work at fucking Walmart or Subway, come on, come the fuck on now, say if they ran out of money? No, they come over there, they get, it's all public attention, publicity stunts going to every fucking talk show, oh, look at me, I'm the, uh, Prince, uh, yeah, Prince, whatever, <laughs> trying, I'm just trying not to bust out laughing, it's like, yeah, you get what I'm saying, right, you know, um, you want to leave the royalty, they want to leave the royalty, but they want to still, uh, reap benefits like it, and say they're not, get, say, what if they ain't getting handouts from wor the royalty they left, oh, they want to, get the same kind of handouts being treated by, like royalty, right? With a manufactured celebrity status, you know, public attention, you know, and uh, pretend to be, like, uh, noble and charitable while still be on a high, high horse, no different than some, uh, some preacher that's uh, many different races, television preachers, million-dollar home and fancy car, and they don't care give a rat's ass about the poor people of their own race or others. Really, they act like it as long as they're getting a, whatever, $80,000 a year or more plus paycheck is given by the people, then act like they're uh, any better than the people that are getting food stamps or government uh, funding or whatever the hell for being poor. But, yeah, and that's, I can go on and on about that. That's another version of, like, corporate welfare. You, know? you got the corporate welfare thing. Certain businesses that will go under, but then other corporations, oh, they're all about to go under. They're failing, right? But they get the privilege of getting uh, government funding or whatever the hell, and they can run the competition other businesses out of business. And 